Shaggy thought it said totally frame, but the L and the Lee were written like elements on the periodic table, aluminum and lithium. The text actually read, T-O-T aluminum lithium frame, meaning that the drone itself was made from a lightweight lithium alloy. Light, but strong enough to carry something heavy like Scarecrow's gas tanks or a pumpkin. All drones, <laughs> go figure. What about the sheriff and Victoria Hassenpfeffer and everyone who got turned into pumpkins? They're still right here. <laughs> My ankles are swollen. <gasps> Everybody got put into the monster's mouth. Then their personal possessions were switched to a jack-o'-lantern drone and sent back out. The big guy here puts out an electromagnetic pulse which disrupts electronics and makes sure that no one can contact the outside world once they've been eaten. The same would have happened to me if I hadn't known what I was getting into. So that weird scarecrow guy did it after all. No, Dr. Crane was telling us the truth. He was framed to draw us in and distract us. Distract us from what? Bill Nye reminded us that Crystal Cove is rich in lithium. The proposed lithium mine would have run under Crystal Cove, but it never happened because the science said it would damage the environment. Oh man, like the town square collapsing. That's right. Someone decided to mine the lithium anyway and engineered this whole mess to cover it up. Someone who's gotten to know us well enough that he can push our buttons. Let's see what happens when we start pushing his. Huh? I'll take the big reveal from here, Velma. Reveal? Who's That's that? What's that happening? Guy. Who is that? The, the sheriff. sheriff! That's right. But Sheriff who? You never bothered to ask. I kept telling you ever since you unmasked the trash monster of Scranton that you were in over your heads. I warned you that if you kept meddling in other people's business, that there would be consequences. It was me. These last few years, it was all me pulling the strings. But why? Because he's not a sheriff at all. This is Cutler Toe, former head of Toe Omnitech, T-O-T, also known as the Trash Monster of Scranton. Sounds like my luck. Um, I'm not seeing it. Huh? That's right. Once you expose my plan to make everyone think a trash monster was causing pollution instead of Toe Omnitech, I went to jail and lost half my stock. To make things worse, scientists said my lithium mine was going to pollute the environment. So I lost that, too. In prison, I'd learned that Dr. Jonathan Crane, a.k.a. the Scarecrow, was a fan of my tech. So I did what anyone in my situation would do. I spent my remaining millions to amass an army of drones and moved to Crystal Cove to impersonate a local sheriff. I use my position as an authority figure to get under your skins. I tell you that you are breaking the law to wear down your confidence, and then tell you I supported you to build it back up. The old hotsy coldsy trick. Once the trap was set, all I had to do was unleash my robotic drills. The robots would extract millions of dollars worth of lithium while I chased everyone out of town with my pumpkin drones and made you kids look like fools! And I'll bet the toxic waste wasn't even toxic waste. Thanks to you, I'm not allowed to have real toxic waste anymore. So I spent another million dollars to buy green glow sticks, and I snapped them all into that tanker truck. And you might have gotten away with it, too, if it weren't for these friends of mine. Friendship's OP! Well, whatever. Go ahead and celebrate. Even you baby geniuses can't arrest a hologram. The real Cutler Toe is in a very fast sports car, packed with more money than you dweebs will ever see in your combined lifetimes. I could be halfway to Guam by now. Not even the feds can catch me. We'll see about that. Right? What do you think, Mr. Nye? Did we keep him talking long enough? Perfect, Velma. He's headed southbound, still on Highway 13 by the Oak exit. Hope that sports car is as swift as justice, Mr. Toe. No! No! That's Toe's car, all right. He couldn't have gotten far. Come on, it's not like someone could just swoop in and grab him. 